Hi guys, it's Sarah and welcome back to my channel. It's been a while, I apologise. I've just not really had the time to film. Um, <laughs> I've been very busy with work, um, trying to work through like a course. So I've not really been able to film, but I'm trying my best because I do miss it. I love YouTube so much, like I actually miss filming. So, I'm going to try my best to film. <laughs> I'm off this week, so that's a bonus. And um, so I'm going to try and get a few videos filmed up. I did film one, like, last week, but I never got the chance to edit it, and I didn't even film an intro, so you're probably going to see me in the same outfit doing the intro for it, and an outro. I don't think I did an outro anyway. Um, pretty sure I didn't. I know I didn't do an intro. But yeah, so I will upload that. I'll get that edited and uploaded at some point. But this is going to be my little comeback video because it's a like, nice little cute video. I love watching these myself. Um, so I thought I would do one. And if you've seen my channel before, you'll know that I've done a lot of these types of videos anyway. <laughs> so what better to bring it back than my favourite type of video, which you've probably seen from the title. It is going to be a Primark um, shopping haul. I did also go to Lush, I got two bath bombs. So I'm gonna show you them as well because I thought one of them is very cute. Um, so it's worth showing. What is this bit of hair doing? So yeah, so I thought I would make my little comeback video with that. And then hopefully I can start uploading again weekly because like I say, it's something that I love doing. And yeah, so. <laughs> Thank you for being patient with me. Thank you for sticking around and waiting for this video. But yes, yeah, so I thought I'd do a little shopping haul. I did go to Primark because I had a few vouchers that I needed to spend. And I met up with one of my friends that I've not seen in so long. So that was really nice. So we went to the Traff Centre um, and I went to Primark and then we went into Lush. And yeah, so it's going to be kind of like a little, it's really itemised because I've started going to the gym like a few months ago and I needed some more gym stuff. So I got some vouchers so I thought I'll buy some gym stuff from Primark. Because to be fair, I didn't realise it was going to be such good quality stuff. Um, I'm saying that, I've only got like a few things. I've not, this isn't like a big shopping haul. Um, but the quality was actually quite good and I've already used one of them. I got two of them so I can still show you but I've already used one of them and it's actually really 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 good. It's survived a gym session with me which is good and I think the quality is quite decent as well and it's quite a thick material like not like really thick like like you can't work out in it but thick as in it's not going to break or rip. So quite impressed with that. I've not tried out the other things yet, but I'm going to show you guys kind of what I got. Like I say, it's only a small haul, so don't expect anything like massive. <laughs> um, but I'm hoping to go back because my friend said near her, where she lives, there's a really big gym section in Primark. And I did want to get some gym leggings, which I didn't manage to get. I saw some there that had pockets, which is a bonus because I literally, I don't get changed at the gym, so I don't use the like lockers or anything so i literally just have my car keys my house keys my phone and my drink but i usually hide i usually yeah hide my house keys in the car i was reluctant to saying that but you don't know where i live and you don't know what gym i go to and you don't know what car i've got so it's all good um but yeah usually you hide my house keys in my car so i only just have my car keys and my phone on me but I use my phone to track kind of what I do anyway, so I need that out. But I just need a pocket, <laughs> just like literally a small pocket for my car keys to go in. That's all I need. I'm literally just carrying it around with me. But yeah, so I was going to get some of them, but they didn't have any in my size. They just had one size left and it was like a double XL or something, which is going to be way too big for me. Um, So it's pretty popular, as you can see. So I think I'm going to end up going to hers to go to her Primark as well. And um, we said we'll go. It's in like a little shopping centre, so if we can go get some food or a drink or something when we go, and it'll be a nice little catch up again. But yeah, so that's kind of what we're gonna do. I've gone into this in a bit more depth, I've not even got into the video. That you are waiting for what I got, <laughs> but like I say, 
like I've said a million times, it is only small, so there's only a few bits. But I thought I'd show you guys anyway, because it's kind of like a gym edition. Um, shopping haul from Primark. So yeah, let's get into it. <laughs> so like I say, it's only a little small bag because I didn't get as much. But we will start with the Primark stuff. So I'm going to start off with what I've already started to wear. Um, so I've got two of these. This is my other one. It's a bit creased because it's been in the bag for a few days. Um, it's just this black basic workout top. And it's like specially designed for the gym as well or any type of workout. And Primark sizes really baffle my head. So I got some sports bras as well, which I've had to go up a size in the sports bra, but then I've gone down to an extra small in the, the sports top. I don't know, Primark size is just back on my head, but yeah, so it's this like silky material like you would expect from gym wear and it's quite stretchy as well, which is good. Maybe that's why, because it's stretchy, I don't know. Um, and it's kind of got like this high neck here and it is quite cropped, but that's good because when you get too hot in the gym, you want as much air as possible to get into your body. Um, so yeah, I've just I picked up two of these short sleeved i cannot wear long sleeve in the gym like i don't know who can do that but i genuinely can't and these were only eight pounds each which i think is a bargain like primark has gone up through the years in prices but still this is a bargain compared to everywhere else um obviously apart from sheen you could probably get them cheaper in sheen um but yeah so it's really soft fabric and it's quite like silky as well and like i say short sleeved it's just a plain basic black crop top um and oh it's 50 percent recycled nylon that's quite cool i love hay fever at this time of month this time of year sorry literally my nose can just start running out of nowhere so that is what i picked up like i said i got two of these um i've already used one so it is in the wash but yeah i'm really happy with that so that is the first one i got this stuck then um next purchase is these sports bras again specially designed it's in the workout wear two pack which i think is pretty good because it's quite hard to find them it's like 10 pound for a two pack so that's five pound each which i don't think is too bad at all um they padded as well both of them have got padded so you don't feel uncomfortable without your bra on um and yeah so it, there's a few different packs that you could get i when i go to the gym i don't feel like i need to wear bright colors i just want to wear basic like black stuff um but this is like a gray -y, like specky i don't even know how to say what color it is but you can see on the camera it's gray and it's got like these black designs down the side and it's got your elastic like i was gonna say waist but it doesn't really go around your waist support your girlies i would say and then there's also like a black one as well it's literally just plain black and again, it does have that detailing on as well, which like the the grey did have. And again, it's got the little elastic at the bottom. And the back of it just looks like this. And they're adjustable, which is a bonus. Because I feel like it's really hard to... Like when you get a sports brand, it's not got the adjustable straps. It is so hard to like... It's easy to grow out of because they can just get really tight. Um, so it's a bonus that it's got the adjustable straps just like a normal bra would and yes for a tenner for two five pound each is not bad and it's got 50% recycled nylon on it I didn't even know this before I bought it but this is so good it says it's got a four way stretch it's quick dry and it's breathable which is really good um, I've not tried these out yet but I'm excited to try these out today because I'm going to the gym with my friend. So I'll probably wear one of these today along with the top. Um, and yeah, I thought this was really nice. And when I tried them, I wasn't sure if I was allowed to try them on. Um, but I tried them on. They let me try them on. And it was very, very comfortable. I'll tell you now. Very comfortable. Um, so yeah, very happy with that. Like I say, I got small in these. But again, it's stretchable. So I don't know. But Primark sizes just really, really confuse me. Um, but yeah size small in that and i'm very very happy about this like i say it feels quite good quality as well like feels like a normal like when you go to the like adidas or jd i say 
it feels like that good quality like that so i'm hoping that this lasts a while i have had a few sports bras from primark in the past and i still wear them to this day so if it's anything good like that then i will be very very happy with this but yeah that was the next thing that I picked up this is the boring stuff i picked up some socks now all the gen z's are saying trainer socks are not cool i always wear trainer socks to the gym but they do end up rubbing me around the end of it because they've fallen down so i kind of understand it for the gym so i picked up some crew socks because these are what the Gen Z is saying are popular. Now, there is five in a pack. I've got a pair on now. Because I've got joggers on. I know, I'm getting in with the trends. Um, but yeah, so it's a five pack. I do have a pair of white ones on at the moment. Um, so there's two black with the white stripes at the top. And then there's three of the white ones with the black stripes at the top. Very, very good quality material. I tell you, when I say it's nice and thick... I don't think there's going to be a hole in these for a few, few like, I'm hoping for a while, to be fair. I have a lot of socks with holes in, so I really needed some new socks. That's one of the main reasons why I picked them up, but also because I needed some comfortable ones for the gym. Now, like I say, five in a pack, so some basic crew socks, £3.50 for five. If I say so myself, that is a bargain. And even better, you would think that the plain black ones, just plain black ones, which I also picked up. I got two pairs. These are not for the gym, which I might end up wearing with the gym. But these are mainly for work because I normally wear crew socks anyway for work. Um, just because it's comfortable. And with the shoes I wear, I want to wear crew socks. I don't want to wear trainer socks. Um, but I've got a lot of holes in them, so I needed to pick up some new ones. So I just bought some basic, basic black ones again. Five pairs, pack. You would think these are more expensive than the ones that I've just shown you. No, these are £2.50. So these, £3.50, these are £2.50. But then again, these, I've got the material because it's kind of like a, what do you call it? Like a ribbed material. I'm going to see if the camera will pick it up. I don't think it's going to pick it up but it's oh there we go it's like a rib material so maybe that's why it's a bit more but these do feel a lot thicker than these ones these feel a bit more thinner but these will do for work i picked up two packs because when i tell you i have holes in my socks it is ridiculous so two packs 10 pairs for five pounds together because it's two pound fifty each not bad at all so that obviously it went to my basket now the last thing i got from primark i've been wanting to buy some of these for a while just to kind of clip my hair away when i'm doing like skincare and makeup so i went when i went to primark i was trying to find the drunk elephant um bronzing drops dupes because primark do them and i was going to try them but we ran out of stock but we literally looked everywhere and they were out of stock but when we're looking for them i found these now everybody has a pack of these i didn't realize primat did them i was nearly ordering them off tiktok shop but i found some that i don't have to pay postage for so i picked up them and there is one two three four five so there's ten why did i just count it when it says ten up there um they're called ten magic hair clips and it says perfect of holding your hair away from your face when washing or applying makeup to your face these hair clips will leave no marks on your hair which bonus if you ask me so i obviously had to pick these up there's five black five pink need i say more <laughs> but i know that a lot of people have got these to hold the hair back so i've jumped on the trend and i've got some myself but yeah for two pound fifty i can't complain i just hope they don't break <laughs> so that is everything from primark now i did get two bath bombs from lush so i'm going to show you them now because i think one of them is very cute the other one i've tried before but i just thought i'll treat myself so i'm going to show you the one that i've had before now they don't stick them anymore so i don't know what it's called but it smells so floral it's really really nice just this pink one and it's got like different colors in it just a basic it's like a rose mm, i don't know it's got kind of like shape at the bottom i suppose if you hold it like that it's like a rose isn't it kind of like design i don't know i'm probably just losing it 
when I tell you it smells so nice, it smells so florally, like relaxing your muscles in this after the gym or after work. Mm, perfect. So I picked that up. Um, oh, I actually have the receipt. It might actually, oh, it's going to tell me on here, isn't it? This will definitely be Sakura for four pounds. Yeah, I remember it being four pounds. Sakura, S A K U R A. That's what this is called. So that is the first one. And then the ne next one I got, which is the last thing in my shopping haul, I thought it was so cute. Obviously, Pride is. I don't know if it's coming up or it's gone. Either way, it's part of the Pride section, but it's so cute. It's called Somewhere. And when I tell you I know this is the one that's called Somewhere, you'll see when I show you what it is. Oh wait, let me put it the right way. So it's nice and cute. Look at it. It's a cute little rainbow. Obviously somewhere over the rainbow. So that's how I know this is the somewhere one. But look how cute it is. It smells so nice as well. Oh, I can't even explain what it smells like. I haven't got much of a sense anyway because hay fever has literally blown my sense out. But I can smell these too. So they must be strong. It just smells so nice and I thought it was so cute. Look at it. And this was, let me see the price, £4.50, which I don't think is too bad at all for Lush. So far, again, I use it after either the gym or a stressful day at work, just to relax myself because I love a good bath. But yes, so that is my little shopping haul for you guys i am really really happy with my purchases and hopefully soon i'll be able to get some more from another primark <laughs> but we'll see but yeah thank you so much for watching i do apologize again about not uploading in a while but hopefully i'm back i'm hoping i'm back really really hope i'm back um but yeah i still have a lot of stuff going on at work like my exams and stuff but it's all good it's all good. Uh, to be fair, if I think about it, I've not really got a lot left, so it's not too bad. But, yeah, so thank you so much for watching. If you liked any of these, let me know. If you do, like, if you have any of these, also let me know. And if you tried the bath bombs, especially the rainbow one, let me know how nice that is. But, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Do appreciate it, like always. And, yeah, I'll see you next time with another video. Thank you. Bye.